In 2019, this job did not exist. Today, it pays 80K plus and companies are desperate to fill it. I'm Abs, a lead DevOps engineer and educator. Five years ago, if you told someone that you were a DevOps engineer, they'd look at you like you were speaking another language. Today is one of the highest paid, most in-demand roles in tech. And the crazy part is most people don't know it exists. In the next two minutes, I'll show you why new job categories create the biggest wealth opportunities and how you can position yourself for the next wave. First, I'm going to explain how emerging roles pay more than established ones. I'll show you what's happening in the market right now and I'll reveal the pattern that predicts the next biggest skill. Here's something people don't understand about career growth, right? The biggest opportunities aren't in the roles that everyone knows about. It's in being early to jobs that people haven't even heard of yet. Think about Bitcoin, for example. No one knew about Bitcoin. So those who invested early, they benefited the most. When social media manager was still new, companies paid 50K plus to get a social media manager. Now it pays 25K because it's become oversaturated and more people know about it, right? The more people that know about the new emerging roles, the less valuable it becomes because the competition is now high. So companies end up paying less. Another example is when data scientists emerged. Early adopters, they demanded really high salaries and they could do that because they're the only ones that had that skill. Now it's taught in every university and that premium is gone, right? You can't be demanding high salaries because the competition is high. Everyone that came out of university has that skill. The pattern is always the same. A new skill emerges, early adopters demand high salaries, the market catches up and the pay then normalizes. But right now, we're in the middle of the biggest infrastructure shift that history has ever seen. Every company is moving to the cloud. Every company needs their system to work 24 seven. Every company is terrified of downtime. But here's the problem. Traditional IT people know servers and networks. Developers know how to code, but almost nobody knows how to bridge the gap between the two. And it's still evolving. They don't know how to make applications run reliably in the cloud and be scalable. That's exactly where DevOps comes in. And companies will pay whatever it takes to find people who can actually keep their systems reliable because the alternative is that their systems will likely crash, they lose business, they lose money, which means DevOps engineers a high leverage people if you just have that skill. Here's what's happening in the market right now. There are 50,000 job openings in DevOps alone in the UK, but there aren't 50,000 qualified DevOps engineers, not even close. Companies are so desperate, they're hiring people with six months of experience or people who came out of a boot camp, paying them 40K plus salaries. On top of that, they're training them just to become DevOps engineers. They're offering remote works, flexible hours, and rapid promotion paths because it's a skill that you know clients are paying big bucks for. While that's happening, traditional IT roles are getting automated or outsourced. Customer service is being replaced by chatbots. Even accounting is becoming software driven. There are accounting AI tools out there right now that have replaced accounting jobs. The question isn't whether your current job will exist in 10 years. The question is, will you be ready for the jobs that will? If you want to know what's coming next, you have to look at what companies are struggling with right now. One big one is AI integration. Every company wants AI, but no one knows how to implement it. The second one is security automations. Cyber attacks are increasing, but there aren't enough security engineers to handle them properly. And edge computing, for example, IoT. Companies need people who understand distributed systems. These are all DevOps specializations that will demand premium salaries in the next three to five years. But only if you start learning DevOps right now, while the market is still fairly new and still forming. And here's the brutal truth. And the brutal truth is that the market won't be this open forever. Right now, you can learn DevOps in six to 12 months and demand 40K plus salaries because the opportunities are still there. The competition is not that high. People think the competition for DevOps is high. It's actually not. You just need to learn the right tools and the right mindset to actually break in. But every month, more people figure it out. More boot camps start teaching it. Every month, the competition is increasing. The people getting rich from emerging job categories aren't the smartest. They're the earliest. They're the ones who were there first. They see the trend before everyone else and they position themselves accordingly. So if you want to know what's coming next and you want to stay ahead of these trends, just hit that subscribe button. We'll break down the job market. We'll tell you what DevOps roles are actually emerging, the specific DevOps tools to learn and where the opportunities are heading. And if you want to stop competing for DevOps opportunities because you don't have the right skills, then I'll consider joining Code Co. The link will be in the description. This is where you learn every DevOps tool you need to land 40 to 50K plus starting salary roles. Remember, the best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. The next best time is now.